How's it going, my fabulous heroes? Today, for Valentine's Day, whether it's Valentine's Day or the day before, we're going to play a game called Hateful Boyfriend. And this game is about romance between pigeons. Haven't you ever wanted to go to a pigeon school where you can date them? I know it's everybody's dream. It's everyone's. And that's what we're doing today, my friends. Let's see how Sagoi Kawaii this game is. Because I know it is, just from the cover. Welcome to St. Pigeonations! Please enter your name. Uh, no! Change that shit, man! Sexy hero. Oh! Hey! God damn it! Sexy hero. Okay. <laughs> Cause we're sexy heroes, aren't we? Oh, you son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! Alright, we're gonna have to add on to that then. <laughs> sexy hero. Rar. <laughs> That'll work. Sexy hero rar. <laughs> okay, let's do this shit. That is our name, guys. Don't question it. Is sexy hero rar okay? Of course I am. Why wouldn't I be? Hateful boyfriend includes a powerful visualization model, allowing even the birdiest of birds to appear as normal humans when first introduced. Display human portraits? I, I guess, yeah. Why not, bro? Configuration saved. Oh god, here we go. This is it. St. Pigeonations! A school blessed with extensive curricula and facilities. It's already been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through these gates. I should probably say, this school is known for one thing in particular. This school is Japan's, no, the world's greatest gathering place for gifted birds. Birds who want to study the arts, the sciences, even sports all come to St. Pigeonations. The teaching staff and student body are both made up of a diverse blend of birds of different backgrounds and species. I'm often asked why I chose to come here, despite not being a bird. It's a long story. Not every day I see you rushing along like this. Ryota! <laughs> I love how it said sexy hero. Usually you'd have been all ready for an hour by now, sexy hero. <laughs> Overslept? Ryota Kawara! This rock dove is named Kawara Ryota. Or Ryuta, whatever. We've been friends since he was barely hatched. He could be a little mischievous, but he's responsible and kind. Breakfast was a little hard to catch today. I can't relax without red meat inside. <laughs> Living as a hunter gatherer sounds tough. I'd be happy to make you breakfast, you know. I might take you up on that offer when starvation looms. Thanks, Ryota! Holy tits! The bell? Come on, we need to hurry to class! Jeepers! No good being late on the first day! <laughs> Gotta go fast! And so, Ryota pulled me along into the school. Today is the start of a new semester. I wonder what lies in store. It was all I could do to adjust to the atmosphere last year. Better make up for all that lost fun. Hateful Boyfriend, the most splendid and greatest academy of the pigeon, by the pigeon and for the pigeon. First term. So beautiful. Isn't it so beautiful? This is the best visual novel any, any creator could make, isn't it? I think we're in two to three. Ryota and I are in the same class again. Old faces, new faces. A strange thrill fills my heart as I look around at the assembled birds. I hope we all get along. Here's to the information of many happy memories. Oh yeah! Oh, the teacher's here! Good morning, everybody! Er, uh, I'm Anaki Kazuaki. I seem to be your teacher this year. I specialize in math and physics and also some other things. We don't give a shit! <laughs> That's pretty much what it's saying. Sir, wake up! It's homeroom! He sleeps with his eyes open? What the hell? Kazuyaki Nanaki! This quail is Nanaki Kazuyaki. He's a famously soporific math professor. I had heard the rumors, but I hadn't expected him to fall asleep just like that. Apparently he's well known as a mathematician. It just goes to show, great minds come in all forms. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. Isn't it a little warm in here? Which reminds me, we have a transfer student. Please introduce yourself, Shiragani. What is the point? I have no wish to speak with commoners! You don't think I'm here because I wish to be! <laughs> oh, well, I guess that's that! 
Hey, hey, hey! That's no good! But he doesn't want to introduce himself! But we can't just let him break the rules like that, sir. The system will collapse and we'll all turn into kulaks and dissenters. Well, when you put it like that, could you at least say your name, Shiragani? Shiragani Lebel Sakuya! <laughs> oh god. It seems this fantail is Shiragani Sakuya. His feathers would make any birdie proud. He's pretty stuck up, but then, transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. Sakuya sits down, glaring daggers at Ryota and me. What a little bitch! I think this little bird is telling me there's going to be trouble down the line. Like I said, what a bitch! Lunch already? Today is slipping by so quickly! That reminds me, I've had these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now. Oh, you're slacking, boy! You're slacking! Where is everyone? Aside from the receptionist, there's hardly any birdie here. Any birdie? <laughs> See what you did there, buddy? Oh, I mean birdie? Huh? Is someone looking at me? Probably just my imagination. Or not. A morning doe stands in a dark corner, staring in my direction. Morning doves aren't very common in Japan, but apparently they're everywhere in America. Um, did do you want something from me? Oh! He looked away. Not really. I'm pretty sure it was him who I felt looking at me. There's no one else here. Are you sure? Yes, I don't want anything with you. It's the things you're carrying that I'm interested in. He glances at the desk, as if to say, hurry up and return them already. Oh, sorry. <laughs> they were a little too dense and I never finished them. Were you waiting for them all summer? He silently returns his gaze to his book. Maybe he's in a bad mood. I'm Rar, sexy hero. A sophomore. How about you? Y your Nagaki. Fujishiro. Nagaki. Freshman. Okay, this guy's a little weird, but... He's kinda shy. Kinda cat to himself. Fujishiro Nagaki, huh? Morning doves are pretty rare in Japan. Maybe it's just his voice, but he seems kinda sad. With hair like that, I don't know why he wouldn't be sad. When was wrong? Leave me alone. He's reading his book again. Okay, sorry to bother you. I keep meeting depressing people today. <laughs> pretty much. Now that I have that out of the way, I think I'll head back to class. Wait, isn't that- Oh god, it's him. You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Come on, Sakuya, what kind of thing is that to say to your own brother, after all these years? My brother? <laughs> you must be joking! You've never once been a brother to me! Please, don't try to talk to me again. I've no time for half-breeds. I'll be going now. Hey, wait just a- Wow, what a little dick! I guess even if we're in the same school now, what's done is done. I hadn't meant to eavesdrop, but I think I just overheard something juicy! The ever-popular trendsetter and ladies' man, Sakazaki Yuya, is Sakuya's brother? PLOT TWIST! OH MY GOD! I wonder what the story behind that is. Hey. Oh shit! You heard that whole thing, right? Are you a friend of Sakuya's? I'm sorry! I didn't mean to listen in on you. Eh? <laughs> no sweat. I tried to stay sexy and suave in front of all you little ladies, but that there wasn't too cool. <laughs> We're just beautiful princesses, aren't we? This fantail pigeon is Sakazaki Yuya, an upperclassman. I've never talked to him before, but he's famous, or infamous, throughout the school. Every birdie knows of him. <laughs> You're sexy hero, right? How did you- I know everybody here. Besides, you're the only human. A single poppy in a field of rye. Did you say you were a friend of Sakia's? Not exactly. We had a rather ballistic introduction this morning. We're in the same class, that's all. I'd never had thought that stuck-up aristocrat wannabe was your brother. Aristocrat wannabe? He's an aristocrat, actually. The genuine article in the flesh. He is? He's a bit of a pain, so good luck, Monami. I do. Probably, probably totally butchered that saying. I probably said that totally wrong, I'm sorry. Don't worry about it, guys. Don't worry about it. It's gonna be okay, just accept it. He really is a noble bird. I've never heard anything like that about you, though. Probably a twisty business. Four, eight. 
That's all for today. Stay safe, everyone! Yeah! Huh? Sir, where's Ryuta? He said he was going to the infirmary. Maybe you should go and see if he's still there. Now that I think about it, Ryuta always did have a weak stomach. I should go to the infirmary just to make sure he's okay. Oh god. What is Ryota up to? Excuse me! He has his period. No birdies here! <laughs> no birdies. <laughs> I can't get over that. There's no one sleeping behind the curtains, and the doctor isn't here either. My hunter gatherer instincts feel no presence. There's no birdie here! Ryuta? No reply. The infirmary is empty. Weird. Did he go to home already? I feel a little nervous poking around the empty room. Now that I think of it, I haven't been in here much before. Unlike Ryota, I'm perfectly healthy. Whoa, they've got all kinds of drugs in here. What do these even do? Care to find out? Oh god! To the doctor? I'll feed you all sorts of things if you want! Hmm? No, thank you! <laughs> This partridge is Iwami Neishu, the school doctor. He's rather creepy in person and has a bad reputation among the student body. Everybody knows that even just talking to him can bring you down with aspergillus, cetacosis, or even worse things. And I never even heard him come in the door. Ninja doctor? <laughs> Seriously, something that big shouldn't be that stealthy. You don't look like you have a good reason to be in here. Did you need something? Uh, I heard Ryuta... Kawara from 2-3 was supposed to be in here. Him? He's already gone. Oh. Why didn't he come find me before going home? Sorry to bother you. I'll be going now. Ah, finally out of that den of evil. Ryuta's already gone home. What do I do now? Oh! I never got around to joining a club last year. Maybe I'll go take a look at some of my options. I think there are clubs for baseball, soccer, track, kendo, migration, bird watching. Wasn't there another one? Anyway, I'll start with the track team. I ran in the middle school, and it's always funny watching the birds hop around. Hey, so did I, you copycat! I think their club room is on the ground floor, off to the side. A white dove is having a tantrum outside. Coo coo! This is no pudding for a man! Okasan rejects it. It is a lie. A vicious falsification. He's dancing around on a squished pudding. Hey, that's not very nice to the pudding. <laughs> this is Okasan. He doesn't really look it, but supposedly he's a fantail pigeon. I think. Either way, he's hyper. Oh god. <laughs> Okasan has suffered a deception most vile. A wretched betrayal. Betrayal? Koo! Okusan instructed that pudding be provided for new members. Koo! But this is no pudding! Ousted, scorned, betrayed! Dragged into the street and shot by those he trusted most. It's squished and filthy, but the thing under his feet looks like normal store-bought pudding. What's wrong with it? Koo koo! Spare the jests, young lady! Okusan used wing attack! It's super effect- God damn it! Those Pokemon references! Good game, creator. Good game. They'll rule the day they crossed Okusan! He'll have them flayed! Hanged! Shut at dawn! He will! Koo! Okusan must now train to retrieve true pudding! Farewell. <laughs> Gotta go fast! And he's gone! He's a good runner, but what does pudding have to do with the track team? Seriously, bruh. And so ended the first day of my second semester at St. Pigeonations. It's so beautiful! I love this school already. I love this school already. Can we like, stop? Okay, I'm gonna save the game right here, guys. I'm gonna save the game right here. All right, let's go to the title. That was day one of Hateful Boyfriend. Oh, this game is already unfolding to be a magnificent thing that every birdie loves. <laughs> but yeah, you know, Valentine's Day is coming up and it's a good time to find true love. Cuckoo, cuckoo, will coo be my Valentine? <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that. We'll definitely be coming back to this game soon. And if you did, please leave a like. It definitely helps me out, heroes. 
And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button to become a pigeon today! <laughs> and, and the hero. Anyways, I love you heroes, stay awesome, and I will see Ku and everybody in the next video! See you later! Sakura sits down, glaring daggers at Ryota and me. What a little bitch! I think this little bird is telling me there's going to be trouble down the line. Like I said, what a bitch! Please, don't try to talk to me again. I have no time for half-breeds. I'll be going now. Wow, what a little dick! Whoa, they've got all kinds of drugs in here. Plot twist! Oh my god! I wonder what the story behind that is.